thank God I had the foresight to do that pipe last night and not this morning, the wind and the rain. Imagine starting off my day wet. That's only okay if you're a woman or a sea creature or a freshwater creature or an amphibian, some amphibians. But I'm none of them, so it would be a fucking disaster. So it's all about foresight, you know. sideways rain well that's that's not that's not true there's loads of things worse than sideways rain like blizzards volcano eruptions asteroids murder rape but sideways rain is not nice oh you dirty rotten rain changes everything come up off that stump that I threw in there. Jesus, damn it. Uh, that's not where I wanted to be. Just going to the bollocks. <sighs> Throw off the load. <laughs> Except for that one time, but we don't talk about that. And those two fives are gonna fit perfectly in there. And then I'm gonna cover them in brash. Like that. Let's see how we go. One. That's it. Stay up. 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 Is this working a tree? This is working a tree. Perfection. See? Told you I never bug. Except for that one time. We don't talk about that. Anyone that's following me for any length of time will know that I'm a man's man. But I'm not able to handle pain. I broke my wrist, my arm, my fingers, my nose, my ankle. Just, I've, I broke loads of things. I even had kidney stones. I had a fucking yolk drove up me fucking dick hole and pulled out, and I just got home with it. So I'm no stranger to pain. I have to hurt myself, and I'm not joking about me eyes water. I'm walking around Grand here now, but every so often I get this shooting pain right fucking there! Not around my dick. Dick and balls is around here and yolks. But no, it's right, right in there. It really hurts. There! The fuck? I'm a fucking winner, dude. You are a winner, dude. Hold well on. Hold well on. Yeah, I'm supposed to be getting support and love from my wife because I have a sore grain and she's just sitting there going, Well, oh, you better be able to perform tonight. <laughs> then, no, I'm you not. bet she did. She she said, That better not affect your performance. <laughs> and I was there. I can't I can't guarantee that it won't affect my performance. But all I can say is I'll give it a good go. I like a right stupid cunt sitting in the van here this morning. This is my second time up to the wood. Because I got here the first time. You know, I wanted to start nice and early and I forgot these. Keys in my machine. Let them fall right down the tip of my dick. Anyway, um, yeah, then I came back up here. And now I'm sitting in the van. And it's hard to get out in that rain. I'm walking all the way down to the machine because we can't get the van down through the mucker and coming down the road. There's only one way out of that wood and that's out on the road and we have to wait until we're finished before the big bow party kinsley comes back and fixes it up and then the cowboys can draw it. And I was hoping Greg would come around that corner with his big four wheel drive van and give me a lift. Because I, I can't. Sore grind injury. But thanks everyone for letting me think that it was a fucking hernia. I've never had groin injuries because I've been so supple and flexible my whole life, do you know what I mean? I rang Greg looking for his ETA and he said, look, I won't be up for a while. I said, Greg, don't worry about it. You're the boss. You can do what you like. Take a nice rest. I might as well get wet and have a sore back along with my sore leg from carrying you fucking bastards. Oh, the heat in the cab when I got in, night heater just worked perfectly last night. That poor little smile on your face, wouldn't it? 
I don't mind anyway. You don't give a fuck. Why, why would you? I will fight for you. I always do until my heart is back in blue. I will stay. I will stay with you. Like lovers do I'll reach my hands out In the dark and wait for yours to Until I can wait for you I'll wait for you Given up, it's too wet. I'm gonna destroy the extraction line. There's too much water. It's just not worth it. The fucking weather. Now I know we live in an island in the middle of the Atlantic, but Jesus fucking Christ. Now I'm gonna get fucking drowned. <sighs> well, there's a good few out there that would love to see my big white cock. And I'm not gonna disappoint. Trying to teach Lily a little bit of autonomy. Mm -hmm. Vicky probably won't be too pleased, but I have her sent in to get a few messages in the mm -hmm. shop on her own. <laughs> well, I'm watching her, right? I can kind of see her. I can see the top of her head. Lily, yeah, you're feeding a child. I'd say we're doing two packs for one. Yeah. So I got two. Good girl. Morning, everyone. Uh, what's not this morning because I've been just getting my beards here and back on the pod seat. Took me a load or two to get used to the crane again, get my bearings in the wood, get accustomed to different lengths. But I'm fine now, it's all going well. I'm up in Strokestown, which I don't really have much to say about Strokestown. I have an awful lot of um, information on it. I know in 1972 the anti clockwise rim job was invented. You know, some probably bored men wanted to see what it was like when the tongue went the other way. There's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that at all. Just. Frank the Tank. Bye Frank. Bye Frank. You know I noticed this morning when I was in the filling station in Roscommon. There was a load of all swag. Vans. Nice ones too. So there must be a shit hot dealer around the place selling vans. And I also noticed that people around Roscommon look down on people that drive Citroëns. Very disappointed in. I was singing a little song on the radio and I had the window down and a large volume of people threw money in at me. So that was uncomfortable. Also quite lucrative. And when I was driving out of the station there was a little foreign woman selling the big issue and she started shouting at me and I was like, no no I don't want it and she pegged 30 euro at me and said look you need this more than I do. the subject of transporters I've seen a gorgeous one in particular this morning in the fin station in Roscommon gold a dark gold with or a burnt orange I'm not really sure with black wheels and black trim on it it was well done sir whoever owned it well done pulled up in Tullamore to get a coffee um, so yeah I needed one the worst of way left my coffee cup in the machine People were wondering what happened there. I got a stick in the eye. That's what happened. And it hurt. And when you're walking around on the forest floor, you have to watch what you're at, you know what I mean? You have to watch what you're at. What? You're a lot of a fast track. 
What is the story with that? No houses in the country to rent or buy. Homeless people everywhere. And they're in the middle of Tullamore. Well, the outskirts. Right across from a pub, a shop, to boarded up, derelict houses. Like, what the fuck? And maybe they're in a floodplain? I don't know, I'm not a dentist. But surely, surely they could be doing something. No? 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 Morong? Morong? Ooh, nice car. This. That's. That's a nice golf. Ooh, tickle my ball sack. That's a nice golf. How are we now? Oh, look at the man. Yes, you're the hardest man to find, Bugs. Maybe I like it's it like that. <laughs> nice. You could have fucking washed it. I'd only do that if I was going to meet the famous lad. <laughs> Yeah, it's cool. Sexy seeds. Yeah. You should give up them, they're bad for you. There's only two of them in Ireland. Really? Yeah. The, pan the panoramic roof looks like a second spoiler, <laughs> doesn't it? It does. Cool. Oh, that's all right. So Lily considers herself my partner in crime, right? Although I think that she only comes in here so she doesn't have to go to bed. No. But <laughs> like Diana. the last time that I um I launched those don't knock me down jackets. What do you call it? Um, do you guys work in the playground? Uh, jackets. Uh, well done. But um, they went pretty fast, so get them really quickly. No, she's not too bad. Them. She's not too bad. Yeah, I didn't make that many of them the first time because yeah, um, only around like eight. They were taking so long and um, not much. Yeah, people loved them, so I got a few I more in. I was actually not expecting them to sell out that, were, that quickly. Little fate. <laughs> Neither did I. <laughs> <laughs> but they are cool. And um, yeah, yeah, I don't know how long they last for. But anyway, I'm going to go to bed. No, I'm not going to go to bed. I'm going to get a cup of tea and then I'm going to go to bed. You are going to bed. No, how about a soft...